morning. This is Arlene. It is February the 11th, 2020. So <clears throat> I just got off work. I'm in Alhambra, California, driving to Los Angeles, California. So I had already done some um, YouTube videos and some live streams um, and tweets regarding the frequencies. So this afternoon, I got frequencies to the left side of my body so I don't know if it was coming from the staircase because on the other side of the wall to me is a staircase then the file room and then there's utility rooms or if it was coming all the way further from outside of the building which it could have been because um, I've used my thermal imaging camera when I was closer to the other side of the building and I detected something coming from the Alhambra Hotel. It allegedly appeared to be so. So it could be that far and behind the Alhambra Hotel is Edison plant. All in alignment to where I was sitting before. So anyways, um, I can't say it's that. I'm just discussing the logistics of it. So anyways, my left side of my body is um, swollen. So um, my left leg, my left butt, the left side of my back, my left arm, my left side of my head, my eye is all swollen from uh, this afternoon while I was sitting at my cubicle. So it was actually like coming from the north. And... It was frequencies that kind of burn and very subtle, but um, it obviously I'm swollen. So, so this morning I got completely burnt from head to toe, and I mean head to toe, I mean from the bottom of my feet to the tip of my head. You know, I got that, and I also. Um, So I got that all day. Uh, I went on my break, got frequencies, did my videos, and I came back, went to lunch, got frequencies in my car, of course. I mean, I'm getting a bell, but because my car, my camera doesn't do close up, you really, you really wouldn't be able to see. Like I'd have to be really close, like this, for you to see the frequencies. So um, that happened. I came back from lunch and continued to get frequencies, especially down below my knee to the bottom of my feet. And my bottom of my feet are so burnt that I took my afternoon walk wearing my flops. So my flops which are Oka Bees. They're made out of recycled plastic. And they did the job. They're very comfortable. So I was able to um, go on my afternoon walk and I did a video then just documenting how, um, how burnt my feet are, my legs, my hands, my arms. So basically everything is burned. I just can't show everything because then it would be a violation of community rules and all that other stuff. And I would get, um, uh, I would get, um, you know, it would be a violation. I'd get in trouble and get kicked off YouTube. And I don't want to do that. I would if I could. So anyways, that's basically what happened to me and um, my arms are like super swollen. So I gotta be careful because sometimes people will run around. <coughs> so anyways, my arms are swollen, uh, my tongue's swollen. So sometimes they have a lisp and it's because my tongue is more swollen so it hits the roof of my mouth differently so i have that um and of course when i go walking you know you kind of see who does a little like security thing standing at the corner or sitting in their car or following your car 
that doesn't bother me at all. They can do whatever they want as long as they respect the boundaries. Because when you cross that, I will take a picture and video you. But um, that doesn't hurt. That's just an annoyance. But getting microwaved and stuff, you know, that it causes discomfort. And that's why I make all my videos because I'm not about to have all that happen to me and then just be quiet about it. So I'm just documenting it. It's not like a lash job or anything, but for me, it's kind of like bitch vomit. You do your video, you get it up there, make sure it's working, and no hacker is fucking with it, and then you move on to the next video because there's always going to be frequencies. It's always going to change. Sometimes new things will happen. You just never know. So. So like right now, I'm getting, I get, uh, one of the things that happens now is I get frequencies from the roof of my car right here, but I don't know if it's from street lights or because it's very thin. So I don't know if it's from the street lights or if there's maybe something, uh, something there, you know, I don't know. Uh, I try to uh, take my car apart or do anything like that. I'm just um, uh, trying to like document it and that's it. So you can see, maybe you can't tell, but my face is pretty swollen. Actually, my face has been swollen for the past couple of years now. So it's not like I'm a, um, um, the old days of like what see my face not swollen don't exist anymore because I'm always swollen all the time the eyes everything the forehead everything is just like swollen the, the um, boobs are swollen the butts are swollen the thighs are swollen everything's just swollen arms swollen armpits swollen just plain old swollen and my cheeks are so swollen they have to be careful that I don't accidentally bite on my cheeks because they're like pressed up against my teeth. That's how swollen it is. Really swollen. So that's um, pretty much everything that, um, well so far the night's not over, that has uh, pretty much happened to me. So, it's weird, but I'm sitting down, and I can tell, like, even sitting in my seat, my, I can tell my left cheek butt is, like, swollen, and my uh, left side is swollen. It's, like, swollen, but it has, like, a slight feeling of being bruised. Like, you ever have a bruise or a sore butt? Kind of like that.
it's kind of like my cubicle, you know, uh, sometimes I get electrical currents and then sometimes I don't get electrical currents. So for me to get electrical currents and then not get electrical currents, um, then uh, somebody has to be doing some kind of work on it. You know, the only people that really could come in are like employees that have a badge, um, custodial, uh, security guards, um, I guess any vendors that have to come in and do work. Uh, like we had uh, the floors done in our lunchroom and the elevator. I mean, it's just, you just really don't know. You know, I'll never know. I'm not trying to find out. But when something happens and it changes, um, you know, all I can do is just talk about it. And also, um, I like to know the date and the time and the city. Sometimes the state, I say the state. Because I want to have that on the video. Um, so, just in case I don't upload it, um, I got to get out of here. Um, just in case I don't upload it right away, the recording is there and it's kind of like my timestamp on there as far as um, what I have done. Talk a little bit in the video to explain what it is. But I have, and separate to today's frequency, and I mean, like, they fried my ass at work um, and stuff. Even when I was on my break walking. But the, the worst was in the morning. That's when I really, I was like, really my boy like blah they got me and it's funny when I get like really targeted hard I don't want to eat anything cooked like I don't want a hamburger good for breakfast I don't want eggs I want like cold cereal everything I want is cold I'm assuming because my inside's hot I don't know but like I want ice cream I want cereal um, I want my water to, I want to drink ice water, um, everything. I just want everything like cold. I normally, I like to drink my water room temperature. That's what I really like. I like my water room temperature. So I, um, So anyways, I like it room temperature, but when I really get fried or cooked, I like everything uh, cold. So um, that's that's what I uh, prefer. But yeah, so that is what happened to me. And um, I know like I'm when I was fostering, like I really enjoyed fostering cats and stuff. But then when I got my fostered my kitten, you know, she was by herself. Um, oh my god, I just fell in love with that cat kitten. She just had this really unique personality. Oh, I'm getting the skunk smell unless there's skunks in downtown Los Angeles, or I doubt there's skunks living in the concrete city. So, um, I feel bad for her because I'm sure she gets targeted or when they come in they probably tease her and I really can't um, I can't uh, dwell on that you know and stuff and imagine you know I just like love her and stuff but I watch her I, I feel her body for bumps I watch her mannerism and she's still a happy-go-lucky cat you know I when the I can hear when the frequencies start in my ear I can hear it I can hear it like click it's on and I notice she can too but she's a cat so I'm sure she senses a lot more than uh, what I sense like um, a lot so um, 
I don't know like while I'm gone if she gets frequencies or not. That's why I like the cat cam because with the cat cam um, I am able to uh, watch her and I have a uh, hacker that likes to knock me off cat cam so like sometimes if cat cam goes off before lunch then I will go home on my lunch and I will um, Picker, I will um, go and turn it back on. Oh, I gotta do this real quick. Sometimes you find cars that are looking for you on the freeway. It's so obvious. This one in front of me is so obvious. Seven GYE one five nine. This wrap. Oh my God, so obvious. This car was like right next to me and. Then it wanted to get right in front of me and stuff. And, uh, yeah, it's that wrap. It's in lane two of the 101 Freeway North. So, um, it's interesting when they do stuff like that. But I'm glad this is a YouTube video, so it's not going to get uh, accidentally deleted or anything. So I can upload it. But yeah, I get that too. Um, oh, getting back to like my cat. She's such a cutie pie. That's my baby. But um, I include her in my YouTube videos because if anything happens to her and stuff, I'm going to document it just the same way I document um, myself. So I started including her in my YouTube videos and my live streams. Now, the live stream, the cat cam that I do, um, there's 7 gyu 159 um, So the cat, cat cam is just really uh, to watch her, like when I'm at work, because she's like, she's gone like for, um, I'm gone actually for like 12 hours. So she's by herself, I need to get her a radio. I keep saying I'm going to do it. I need to get her a radio so she can listen to music because the only thing she listens to is if I have the air conditioning the, or the fan on the air conditioning on and I pop the window open like about two inches. <coughs> so anyways, um, I do worry about her because she is my baby and I am responsible for her. Um, and her well-being so I try to make sure you know I uh, like cat cam but I'm sure whoever's hacking me is probably a resident inside my apartment building and they like to turn off cat go through periods where they like to turn off cat cam so they know I'm gonna come but then I don't know if it's because they know I'm gonna come because um, they can do something out somewhere else I have no idea but anyways uh, I do that um, when cat cam goes off and it is um, in the afternoon I mean there's nothing I can do about it and I usually will live stream all the way home and um, just to see and I just like telling people hey you know what cat cam's off I, um, I don't know how my cat's doing. I hope they didn't harm her or abuse her. And there it is again, the rap right next to me. I'm telling you. Now, that's, that one has no shame in the game. When they do stuff like that, I kind of wonder, like, how much money do you get? You probably don't give a fuck. So, anyways. So, that's what I do. And um, I try and spend time with her when I'm home and stuff. I like to stay home and then I like to do things. So it's a, it's a half and half thing that I like to do. And there goes my tailgater out of State Plates, Prius. And lane two on the 101 North. And then I got my RAV behind me. Like 
wingman style. Oh, someone's zapping my butt. Is that way back there is doing it or is it my car? So, um, yeah, so she's a cute cat and I really uh, like her. Love her. And, um, there's not much I can do about it. I know there's other people that I've talked to and they, they know their animals. They can tell like when their animals are, are getting something. So, um, you know, it is something common. But I just try to love her as much as I can. So it's interesting. I In my prior live stream when I was talking, when I talk and I'm in selfie mode doing a video, like I, especially at night, I will have cars doing drive-bys, kind of creep over, 